And here's a quick tip. Sometimes the burning on the edge of this piece of cherry is a result not necessarily from a dull blade, but one that has a buildup of pitch and gum and tar behind the faces of this cutting edge. You'll see that here on this table saw blade. You can also see this here on the router bit. It's real easy to take care of that. Let me show you a method. First, we'll take this saw blade and set it in this shallow pan. It's actually the top of a five gallon container. And there's a couple of different cleaning solutions you can use. One is oven cleaner, a bit caustic and people aren't always inclined to use that. But here's a couple of products that are relatively easy to get. This one is a dedicated bit and blade cleaner, but something as simple as this fantastic works very well too. And we're gonna kind of fill this pan with this cleaner. Now this cleaner is very gentle, it works very well, but it is gonna take just a little bit of time to soften that pitch and gum buildup. We've let this blade sit in here for a few minutes, and I think you'll see that the pitch and gum comes off pretty quickly. This is a soft little brass brush. It'll take just a second to go around the entire blade and make sure you clean each one of those faces, and then rinse this, or make sure that you rinse this in a little clear water and let it dry before you'd use it. And lastly, when you're going to do router bits, again, we want to use the same process to clean those, those faces. Please make sure you take off the bearing. Sometimes that cleaner in the bearing will remove some of that grease. So as long as the router bit feels nice and smooth when it runs through the bearing, I like to hold it in one hand and spin the bit. As long as there's no grinding or gristly type feel, take the bearing off, clean your bit, and then put that bearing back on again. If you do feel a little bit of a drag, you can lubricate that bearing, and it'll be just as good as new. Now you may want to do this process more often when cutting more resinous woods like pine and things like that because the pitch and gum and tar buildup is much faster with those woods. Mm -hmm.